Hello Geeker Things, Wade here, and this time we have some new toy related news for Season 11 of Doctor Who. Some of the toy licenses have officially revealed their products, and let's check them out. This is for the 13th Doctor, so it's Jodie Whittaker, and let's look at the very first piece they showed off. This is a 10 inch action figure produced by Character Options. Yes, you heard me correctly, Character Options is finally back in the game. And the description says, One of the most iconic sci-fi characters ever has returned in her 13th incarnation for all new adventures across space and time. Exploring the universe in her time-traveling TARDIS, sonic screwdriver in hand, the 13th Doctor is ready to sort right from wrong and save civilizations throughout the galaxy. This is 10 inches or 26 centimeters in height. They claim this is highly detailed and fully articulated. It has real fabric, high-waisted culottes, rainbow-striped black shirt, and lilac coat. It includes her sonic screwdriver as an accessory, and character option says encourages imaginative play. To me, that's a weird thing to put in the description of your own action figure. What's wrong with realistic play. Am I supposed to imagine her in her TARDIS and imagine her fighting Daleks? Cause that ain't gonna work in my mind. But on a serious note, character options did manage to produce a good looking figure. That looks like Jodie Whittaker. And what's neat with this figure is they made it even better by the use of 3D scan data. And interestingly, they do say it's by chance that she's perfectly in scale with the 2006 12 inch Doctor Who range. So this ends up working in 12 inch collector's favor. So this leaves the question, will we get a 5.5 inch scaled figure of the 13th Doctor? I'm sure we will in the future, but I do find it interesting they haven't released it yet, and they showcase a 10 inch figure first. It has been a really long time since we've ever seen a 12 inch scale figure produced by character options. Alright, let's see what else they have of the 13th Doctor. This one is brought to you by Funko, and this is part of their Rock Candy collection. I honestly don't know a single thing about this line. To be honest, it doesn't look like Jodie Whittaker at all. Head sculpt isn't there, hair isn't even there. Outfit, sure, but I really don't know what they're striving to achieve with this. Now they have two different photos for this rock candy doctor, and just look at them. They look completely different. I have no idea which is the prototype and which is going to be the real deal. It's leaving me confused. Here's another piece of merchandise people are bound to buy. Look, Titan's vinyl figures. Oh my gosh. I can't believe these things are still a thing. What am I looking at right now? That is terrifying. Sure, it looks like Jodie Whittaker, but I do not want to see her in a body like that. And it's six and a half inches? That's bigger than my Black Series action figures. There's... Something not right with that. I mean, this is terrifying. Okay, maybe I'm exaggerating, but this is hilarious. They're using the hashtag, we love Titans. No, we don't. We never wanted these in the first place. I mean, if some people want to buy them, I'll let them buy them. But this is like a bootleg pop vinyl and Titans was just trying to cash in on the market and they had no idea what they were doing. Much like how Hasbro is with Mighty Mugs. Yeah, these kind of things have never been my style, and I don't think they ever will. I didn't even like the Dalek ones they produced. That ought to tell you something. <laughs> we shall rule the world. Speaking of Titans, here's another one. It's in the same scale, and this time it's one of their kawaii Titans. This is kind of anime inspired, and I really don't understand this. Once again, not my cup of tea, but I'm sure there's some collectors out there who really do enjoy these. Hashtag we love Titans. But I think it's a lot better than their regular Titan figures, if that means anything. Now, I didn't intentionally mean to save the best for last, but it's really the best that we've seen so far, until we see a 5.5 inch figure. But, so far, the top of my list, it's Funko Pop's 13th Doctor. It's the 
best piece of merchandise I've seen so far, and it's the most appealing to me personally, though I would rather see an action figure, but Funko nailed it, I think. This is the strongest contender so far for what they've shown. Does it mean I'm gonna buy it? Maybe or maybe not. Like I said, I'm an action figure guy, but I want you guys to tell me what you think of the new merchandise they've shown off. Are you a Titans fan or are you a Funko fan? Make sure to leave a like for Funko and then comment for Titans. I want to see who will win in this battle of the century. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching and as always stay tuned for more Geeker Things.